All right, good afternoon, y'all. The court before not the clean service here at the scrap yard. Just made it in for a nice load here. Weighed in about 1,200 pounds here, man. Getting ready to get this stuff offloaded here, man. That's about 3.30 my time, man. Nice, beautiful day here in Georgia, man. It's about 96, 97 degrees out here. It's pretty hot out here, man. Pretty hot out here, man. But that's another story, man. So yeah, I weighed in, man. I got here, man, about about three o'clock my time here, man. Uh, and uh, you know, it was a lot of scrap metal out there, man. I had to kind of do some ride around, some digging around. I had to stop by some doors and knocking ass. I had to do a little dumpster diving, but hey, got through the day, made it happen, man. So I'm gonna show you guys what I have on the back of the trailer, man. Let me show you guys what I have on the back of the trailer. All right, guys, like I said, man, everything was kind of slow today, man. I had to kind of get out there and do some extra work today, man. You know, but that's, you know, that's normal, man. Get out there and do a little knocking, man, a little dumpster down, a little digging. But guess what? We made it happen, man. Made this day happen, man. And, you know, got a nice little load here. Weighed in about 1,200 pounds, man. 1,200 pounds here, man. Uh, nice little refrigerators. Two refrigerators back here. One of the refrigerators work, but the door and the inside of it is very nasty in the inside of it, man. So it's something that I'm not going to take to the house. Uh, whoever were renting the house, man, they just left the house like it was, man. And um, they left the refrigerator with food inside of it and stuff like that, man. So we had to throw the food inside of a dumpster, man. And then once we got the food into a dumpster, we, um, you know, I pretty much load the refrigerator up, you know, and it has some other stuff back there, some trampolines and stuff like that. That was um, back there in the backyard. I got this stuff all loaded up, man. And so pretty much got it, uh, got the stuff loaded up, man. And I'm not going to be doing any breaking down today, man. Um, and the reason why that for, man, is uh, I got somewhere to be with my wife. Um, so I'm getting ready to head out from here, man. And uh, my wife and I got somewhere we got to go. So I'm just going to get this offloaded today, man. Now, it is some motors on the back of the refrigerators and stuff like that. And uh, it is some components inside here. Uh, this here is a tower before a computer. If you dig through here, um, they have a lot of uh, components inside of this tower. Uh, it's a good breakdown if you break it down. I'm not going to break it down and mess with it, man. But you can go inside of it, man. They got a, a, a lot of gems inside there, man, that uh, you can get paid pretty good for. And I got some other little things that I have on him um, that I'm just going to get everything offloaded off this trailer today, man. And, uh, you know, I get back to breaking things down tomorrow, man. But let me show you guys the scrapyard, man. You got these guys over here, man, getting their stuff offloaded, man, getting their stuff dropped off, man. And, you know, you got some stuff up here. Uh, it's kind of, it's kind of. The, the, the scrap metal seem kind of high on one side, but like I said, man, it's just look to be deceiving. So if you go on the other side, man, uh, it's empty, man. It's still empty. It's still empty, man. You know, look, it's, I'm the only person beside the guy over there that's out here right now, man. Uh, and the scrap metal, like I said, man, with the price of gas and stuff like that, a lot of people are kind of opting out of it, man. Opting out, man, because it's a little bit too much for them, man. Look over here. Somebody put a whole bunch of car parts. Look at this Cadillac converter. Let's take a look at this Cadillac converter inside of here. A couple of Cadillac converters here. Here go Cadillac converter here. Let me see see that that platinum inside there i don't know if you guys can see that um it's a whole bunch of platinum inside that Cadillac converter inside there uh which is a nice lick man and now you know here in georgia you got to have a license to turn into Cadillac converter or it could be your own personal Cadillac converter where you took off your car and you just took it and you work out but yeah that's a nice lick right there if that was four uh that probably be about five to six hundred dollars on that Cadillac converter alone you know so Nice little car park, man. I love walking around this scrap yard, man, because there's a lot of hidden gems that people throw out here, man. Some of the stuff, man, you can trade for, and some of the stuff you can't. Um, but uh, I like trading. I like trading. I like walking around, man. I, you know, somebody uh, brought a truck in and dumped all these car parts here. Uh, let me see. You like it came off a of Chrysler Motors 3.5 V6, you know? So yeah, just stuff around here, man. Look like another cat here. Now I don't think that's the Cadillac Converter. Could be. Let me see. Uh, doesn't look like one. Let me see here. Nah, no, that's not one. This can be deceiving, but uh, that has uh, see that? Oh, that's not one. Uh -huh. But I'm pretty sure, man. Once they kind of get to moving this pile and moving stuff around, they'll find a lot of Cadillac converters inside here. There's a lot of them around here, man. You know. Uh, the original Cadillac converter pays good money, man. I love digging through these piles and seeing what I can find, man. Let me see what is this. No, nah, that's not one either. You know, you see that hole in there, so that's not a Cadillac. You know, Cadillac converter don't be full with platinum, man. You make a lot of money off of them. I love picking them up. Um, nice little lick. Um, let me see. Let's kind of walk through here and see what else we can find. Is this a Cadillac converter here? No, that's not one. That's pretty much it, man. Look inside here. Somebody threw an S box away. <laughs> Got an S box inside there, man. They threw the S box away and stuff like that, man. So, you know, hey, the television, man. They normally don't take television out here, but I guess, hey, they might have just told them to drop it all off. So, you know, it is what it is, you know. Let me see here. Uh, lawn mowers, round lawn mowers, and stuff like that, man. I can tell you, man, I came out here and put together a nice round lawn mower. 
and I had that lawnmower for years. I brought the body out here. I got the motor from out here. I got I got everything, the tires, the wheels, you name it. I got it all from out here, put the ride lawnmower together. And I had that ride lawnmower for like three or four years and rent perfect and sold it. Got rid of it, man. I sold it for uh, probably about $300, man. Uh, a lawnmower that I put together, I just traded everything off for what I had on my trailer, man. So yeah, that's pretty much it, man. That's pretty much it, man. It's pretty much it. Somebody bought some fencing out here. You know, so some fencing and stuff like that, man. So that's pretty much it, man. So guys, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the day, man. I'm gonna go ahead and get the trailer offloaded today, man. You know, and um, I gotta go meet up with the wife, man. So I'll holler at you guys tomorrow. You guys be best out there. Stay safe. Peace.